Right, the penultimate zone in Krasarang Wilds, um, Temple of the Red Crane, and we're doing. So, except for the quest, I'm ready. Let's accompany Koro on his journey. You will die in the mud like your friend over there. Wrong answer. Oh, it's a bit vicious. Oh well, looks like we're going in blind. I'm glad you're with us, Fidelity. Okay. Stay close and keep your eyes peeled. Okay, no doubt there's going to be some fights of some sort. An ultimate part of this zone. Well, I'm going to miss it. This has been this has been a journey. It's not over yet. Whoa, look out! Whoa, archers. Where are they coming from? Oh, wow. It seems they took out most of uh, most of our men. Okay, head down. Help for the DK. I, I took an arrow in the knee. Oh, Jesus. Not them too. Oh, God. Wow. Some jokes just don't die. <sighs> well, that's the episode title sorted out. Right, I think it's just me and him now. Oh, there's more of them. I knee, I'm sorry for the DK, I can't fight like this. Oh, I'll take them. Easy. Oh, I've accompanied him. The camp is just ahead. We should be able to make it from here. Crane Wing Refuge, it's called. Alright, I can have my quest in. Oh, it's the same guy. <laughs> okay. Um, yeah, complete. Oh, got two more quests. Blinding the River Slades. Got to kill eight of those guys. Tread lightly. Oh, I've got to set off ten spike traps from a safe distance. This sounds fun. Any more quests around? Oh yeah, there's one here. Oh look, there's a quest from the little Prince of Stormwind. Still hanging around. He should be at home where it's safe. But no. He wouldn't. Right, here's the first one of these traps that I need to set off from a safe distance. Ooh. Ooh, prodding it with my stick. <laughs> wow, those do look nasty. One pass stalker down. Oh, here's another trap. Go take out this trap. Love the stick animation, it's hilarious. Uh, a couple of guys. Um, oh, another trap. Oh, there we go. Five out of ten, five to go. And I'll take this guy up here. Easy. Hear the drums of war coming now and the music. Somewhat appropriate, I think, for this zone. Now, apparently, in this zone, um, in future patches, it's going to turn into more and more of a PvP zone as the Alliance and Horde set up fortifications in it and oppose each other more, I suppose. I mean, it look to me, it looks like there's enough Shah popping about anyway without the uh, prospect of war. Don't know how bad it will be. But it should be interesting. It's nice to see that they're keeping the zones dynamic and keeping them changing. 
And uh, I don't think I've ever had a quest where I've had to poke something with a stick before. So that's so that's new. <laughs> Oh, I think it's our last trap. Ten out of ten. Oh, ought to take this more. Right, that's that. Now let's uh, let's get these heads from these stalkers. Mud scale heads. Right, there's one. There's two. They don't drop very often, you know, considering that each of these beasts has a head. You know, it doesn't seem very realistic somehow. You'd think you'd just have to kill six of them. But no, it's more like nine, I think. Right, one more to go. And there it is. Good. Six out of six. Let's go hand those three quests in and see where they lead us. From what the uh, original quest said, I think there's meant to be more Shah around in the temple. I haven't actually been to the actual temple yet, so we should take a look at that. But the Shah quests are being rather milked in uh, in this expansion. Which is fair enough, because they are pretty big and like the big badass enemy. And... Uh, Weirdly caused by the Alliance and Horde in some ways, which is interesting. It's a nice way of kind of bigging up the uh, the conflict between them into kind of a physical form. And well, one of them is a big uh, raid boss, so interesting to see. Oh, I've got a question man. Do we didn't kill Shah near six hopeless monks? Doo -doo 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 -doo. Here they are. Oh, this is a bit like uh, the Jade Forest rather than um, the earlier Crash Rang Wilds ones. We've got the big ones, which are a bit harder to kill, and there's an elite hanging around. But it seems because Andwin's with me, I get health whenever I kill them. Which is very useful actually. Because they can do a fair amount of damage. Still, Temple of Red Crane's cool. It's not quite the Jade Serpent, but it's still pretty cool. Oh, look, I've inspired someone. <laughs> Ah, uh, these quests never fail to amuse me. Despite the fact that this is deadly serious. There's a real sense of storyline in Pandaria, which we... I don't want to say haven't always had in expansions, because there's always been kind of an arc towards a main arch villain. But I feel there's a real sense of purpose in this, even if it isn't leading towards one climactic event. Possibly just because of the zones and the areas and what they're like. I don't know, but it's makes for good gaming. I mean, Blizzard have outdone themselves this time. I suppose it makes up for the, uh, I'm not going to say disappointment, but uh, cataclysm anyway. <laughs> it was alright, but... Wasn't Chinese enough. That's, that's, that's the problem, obviously. Yeah. Nine out of eighteen manifestations slain. A couple more here. Let's try and inspire this hopeless acolyte. Oh look, we inspired him.
I'm gonna take this one. Alright, let's finish off this big guy. Alright, 15 out of 18. Okay, it seems the big guys, when you kill them, you get more health than the small guys, which is fair enough, because the big guys are actually quite a threat. Small guys really aren't. I don't know who this guy is for. I don't know. The guy in the middle. There's a quest for him or not? I don't know. Not too sure. Anyway, let's hand in the uh, the uh, first quest to Anduin. And let's go sort out the other two. I need to go and take out the guy up here, it seems. More of despair. One from each side. Um, in the uh, East Pagoda and the West Pagoda. What's a pagoda? It's like a word. Must be a type of building, I assume, or turret, part of a temple. Actually, I have no idea. Oh, it looks like he's got little guys we've got to kill as well. Just AoE them, I think. Yeah, it seems to be the way to do it. Right, and and the West Pagoda guy. Still feel weird saying Pagoda. Pagoda. Sounds like um, a planet from Star Wars. Pagoda. You know? Just me? <laughs> okay. That's him taken out. Let's just get rid of his ads. Cool. And uh, I guess we can hand that quest in. Oh, get a new one-hander that's not as good as my my two. It probably still looks like a plank with a nail in it. <sighs> right, I need to inspire three more of these guys. Oh, last one. Oh, we've inspired him. Good, good. Oh, bit laggy. <laughs> there we go. Yeah, there's been a bit of lag on the server lately. Oh, watch this. <laughs> Enter the basement and and defeat the Shah of Despair. Oh, Christ. Big boss fight. Okay, I can do this. This will be easy. <laughs> um, last words. <laughs> In, mm, I don't know, basement anyway. Around here. Wow, this is it the big climactic fight for the Temple of the Red Crane. We must save the spirit of the Red Crane. Can we take out the Shah of Despair? Can I keep talking dramatically with this music going? Will we make it? Can it be done? Run away! <laughs> Actually, it's not going amazingly, is it? Oh, I might die. I mean, oh, oh, he's, he's spawning ads. Of course he is, he's spawning ads. Brilliant. Just what he needs, back up. Actually, though, if I kill these, I might get... I do! I do, I get health for killing these guys. So... <sighs> Still don't know whether I can solo this, because he does some pretty strong attacks. And it's very laggy, which means my moves aren't working all the time. Oh god, look, I'm nearly dead. Run away! Use Death Strike, or something, that will heal me. God. Oh, oh, it looks like I've got someone helping out. 
That's good. Orc Shaman. Ugh, hordy. Don't really care, he's helping. Oh. Should take out this guy. In the hope of getting a bit more health. Oh. It is done. He is down. We are victorious. The red crane descends. We did it. Ah. Nothing like a good old bit of victory. It seems hope has triumphed after all. There is no time for celebration. Many followers on the way still battle outside. Meet me at the statue at the centre of the temple grounds. Right, oh, I get a cool new waist. And that's it, Temple of the Red Crane. Done. Finished. One little zone left. Nayeli Lagoon. And I've got some odd quest from him.